Hey guys, for this video we're going to take a quick look at this Astro AI multifunctional folding snow shovel. Recently picked this up to keep in the truck for the winter. You never know when you may get stuck or just need a shovel and being able to fold up and not take up a lot of space. I thought it was really uh, a good idea there. And I'm sure you can use it for other like maybe off-roading stuff in addition to just snow. But I wanted to show you guys how it works and get a couple of measurements so you can get an idea of the size of the shovel. But first off, I already put the handle on, but you can take the handle off. Just these little push buttons right here. Push them in and then pull it back. So it does get a little bit smaller because you also get this little like plastic vinyl type pouch with the drawstring on top. Now, if you want to be able to close the drawstring, you do have to take the handle off and put it you know, in the bag with it. Um, but as far as the, the shovel itself, as it folds out, there's a little spring level, little spring loaded guy right here and you push him back and it'll just pop into place like so. And now we have our, our business end all ready to go. And then to release that, it's just this collar right here. You can grab the plastic part, or I think it's a little easier to grab the metal ring right there, but just pull it up, bring this guy back down and uh, you can fill it all up. So that portion is really nice and easy. I like we got some pretty beefy steel there that I think will feel real good about that. And uh, just in case anyone cares, let's get a couple measurements of the shovel itself from the outside to the outside here, if it'll stay in place for me, is about eight and a quarter inches. And if we get the entire length of this guy right here, that's about 13 inches. Now, for the handle portion, we have the shorty, shorty mode right here. And let's just see, let's just do the handle itself here from the pivot point all the way to the end of the D handle is 21 and three quarters in short mode. And then to get it to long mode, oh, no wait, there we go. Got to push these buttons in first and then pop it in and it locks into long mode and give you the same measurements from there. We are at about 28 and a half when in that mode there. And it's all aluminum. By the way, it is pretty lightweight. It was two pounds, four ounces when I put it on my scale. Got rivets there. Our little push buttons there and then that's what also holds in the handle our little spring loaded guys here now the only thing is i kind of wish the handle wasn't plastic and that it was aluminum as well or if it at least had some metal going in here to add some reinforcement because i feel like if there's any weak point it's either going to be the handle or these little spring loaded guys although those i think have a pretty good track record of, of working maybe get stuck every once in a while but they might be all right so the handle there but, you know, if you think about snow shovels, almost all of them have a plastic handle, so it's not abnormal. But I was just thinking using the shovel for other purposes, if you don't really want to lean on this D handle here just being plastic, I imagine that is probably the weakest point of it. But for snow and general purpose, you know, I'm sure it's fine. But there it is. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I think that's, like, if you look at how thick the steel is for the shovel portion... I'm really happy with that. I like how small it'll get. And I don't know if I'll use that pouch or not, but this will definitely fit underneath my seat in the truck. So it won't take up any additional space and I'll have it just in case we need it. I'm gonna show you the handle portion just kind of slides off like so. See if I can push those buttons in. So then there's your handle coming off. And then we just push this guy in again like we did before. And then from there, you can just put it in the bag. So it gets pretty compact. I think I like it. I think it'll work. When the snow flies, we'll be able to actually use it, but thankfully there's no snow right now. So there it is. Thanks for watching.